There's a lack of parental controls. Parents often don't know what their children are doing online. Teens access sites, social platforms, and chat rooms that completely fly under the radar for adults. Caitlin Keenahan sat down with a therapist who says some teens are getting sneakier. The Kids Count Data Center shows one in 10 kids in East Tennessee are diagnosed with anxiety or depression, and social media is a big pressure point for that. In fact, several studies show that overconsumption of social media is directly linked to mental health issues. We're seeing kids that are seven years old that have phones. If you hashtag mental health on TikTok, there are 43 billion views and videos at your fingertips. The depression, I call it a Tuesday. And Wednesday and Thursday and Friday. But there's also a dark side to this technology. We're seeing a high rate of children who are victims from other children, uh, children that have exposure to pornography, children that have exposure to some things in the home that they're seeing, or are victims themselves are victimizing other children. Vonda McGill is the director of Child Health Advocacy Center. She's also a therapist who knows what kids are doing online and in private. I have clients that come in and they talk about having a burner phone, a burner phone, which is basically a phone that they got from a friend that their parent doesn't know that they have. That's how some kids get exposed to adult sites, chat rooms, and social media algorithms. In fact, many of our children are being exploited on these sites and that's what actually has brought them to child help. The biggest word of advice from the Advocacy Center is to know who your children are talking to, set up parental controls, and monitor their social pages. In Knoxville, I'm Caitlin Keenahan. There are apps parents can sync on their children's phones to check search history and social media pages. These apps can even alert parents to issues like sexting, cyberbullying, and depression. A few of those are Net Nanny, Life360, and Bark.